The catering staff were making final preparations as the guests started arriving. Ambassadors and senior officials from 31 Islamic countries. Saudi Arabia's large embassy here hosts an ambassador's iftar every Ramadan. All of these uh, ambassadors from the Islamic countries and the, the military attaches um, and as well as uh, senior uh, American officials in the US uh, who are of the Islamic faith in order to celebrate this holy month. And this is uh, part of this long-standing tradition that has gone on for several decades now. Ramadan is a good time to remember that in the eyes of the Almighty, all people are equal. Abdullah Khodj Imam of a major historic mosque here in Washington says that is the value of Islam and fasting. It makes us all respond to the command of Allah and we feel all are equal in the sight of Allah regardless of the position of the individual in this world. So all of them, they abstain from food and drink from dawn to sunset. At the prescribed time, the call of the Mu'adhin signaled the end of the day's fast. Guests partook of dates and drinks before praying. The ambassador of Jordan said that of the many receptions that diplomats are called on to attend here, this event is particularly welcome. This is, an, uh, of course, it's an annual event uh, where His Excellency the Ambassador uh, invites the diplomatic corps. Uh, when we come here, we feel at home, we feel closer to um, everything that this month uh, means uh, to us uh, in, in, the, in, the, in the diplomatic corps as well as in, in, the, in our part of the world, be it in the Arab or the Muslim countries. It's all about tolerance, it's all about values, all about the principles of Islam, it's all about understanding the other. And this is a great opportunity for us to uh, get together and um, you know, touch base on important things. And uh, the holy month of Ramadan and being here in the embassy of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia is just the perfect place uh, for, it's an umbrella to be able to discuss all the matters that are extremely relevant to Arabs and Muslims. The newly arrived ambassador of Senegal said he was happy to be able to break the fast with other Muslim diplomats. Yeah, you know, Ramadan is a very important period in a Muslim's life. And uh, it is a time when people uh, follow the instructions and uh, recommendations of God. And uh, it's also very important for us to be here because, as you know, Saudi Arabia is hosting uh, very important uh, symbols of, of Islam. Mecca is there, is there. Prophet Muhammad, uh, peace be upon him, uh, is, is, was, was from there. So it was, it's very important for us to be here just to, to commemorate uh, this, this moment and also to be together and also reflect on the true values of, of Islam, which are values of tolerance, values of togetherness, and values also of, uh, of helping and respecting human life. After prayers, the guests went into a dining room where they had a lavish meal of Middle Eastern appetizers followed by a buffet of various meats and fish accompanied by rice, fried eggplant and salad. The ambassador's iftar is a long tradition here. It's a valued occasion for representatives of the Islamic countries to come together to break their day's fast, to hobnob and to discuss issues both big and small, all while enjoying the sumptuous hospitality of the kingdom's embassy. Burton Bolag, KSA2, Washington.